Good morning, campers. Last time in the last episode, we left off. We have finished Battle Rock Galaxy, we finished uh, Hurry Scary Galaxy, and we finished the Green Plane. You roll around on a Star Ball Galaxy. Now we're going to feed this Hungry Luma 400 Star Bits. Mmm. <coughs> seems that I had some sort of connection with this little Hungry Luma. I developed gas, I don't know. Trying to use a very fun vocabulary. But now we have the Sling Pod Galaxy, which we will be doing this episode. So let's just launch ourselves over to that galaxy. And a very sticky situation. Ooh. I wonder what this could. Oh, no. No, no. This is indeed a very sticky situation. Oh god. The thing is I hate these this one. This one sucks. This one just align it. Not only that you have to align it, but you have to wait like the perfect moment to shoot yourself over there. And these spinning things, that doesn't really help. No! 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 Frick. Alright, so I finally made it to this segment. After getting... You get about like 20 star bits. Like, per this course. So, just letting you know. That's how much I s failed at it. So, now we got the pole star thing. And this won't be that hard. There's star bits all over the place. But, I mean, if you waste your time getting all these star bits, you're gonna... End up getting effed up, so I wouldn't do that if I were you, because I'm sure there's some bad thing. I want to get that only because, oh wait, there's a thing over there, because the star bits are sort of like a directory, and they will direct you, basically. So if you, you know if you miss them and you're like, oh god, I am gonna die. Let's just get all those yummy star bits. No, 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 no. So I made it back here, and let's hope for the best. that we make it to this new spectrum. Yes. Oh god, those things will come back and hurt me, won't they? Finally did it. Holy shit. You have no idea. 17 minutes that took. And I have the star bits to prove it. Holy crap. What the fuck? So that's our 26 star, and there's a galaxy coin. There's are two, two coins. Cool, that's amazing. But, just... yeah, that's that's how many star bits I have. Yep, that's great. Wonderful. What was that? Was, did I collect, did I collect like 600 something, or just 500 something? Either way, that's ridiculous. And I'm, I'm, oh, I'm, 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 I'm be, be fonded. That's not a word, but whatever. So we need to head over to... Boozy Maguji's Battle Float Frontier. You know, it's not what it's called at all. To hop Scotch up here and go to Bowser's Little Galaxy because we completed all these. So we opened up this and it's Bowser's Star Reactor. Oh, Bowser's Reactors. We're gonna make it hurt. What's with all? What's with naming these all reactors? That's that's just a big slap in the face to me. I mean, come on. You couldn't pick a better word? The Fiery Stronghold. So I guess these are all called reactor... Reactor levels, and... Honestly, they kind of make my reactor hurt, and it's a bit upsetting, so... We got some suns up there. Not Bowser's sun. Alright, you see where I'm gonna go with this, so I better just stop. It's Bowser Jr., but... No one needs to know about that. 
I don't need to make bad jokes. Oh, a one up. I'll need one of those because they're freaking used a whole bunch of them. A lot of coins. That's cool. We got a fire flood. Okay, and a swamp. Swamp, do you have anything on you? For some, like, I like how they made swamps accessible. Like, you can now, like, jump on swamp. What just happened? Dissing? That was better. Alright, well, ne so next, I won't, okay, yeah. That was weird, though. It was just sort of like, yeah, you're gonna die now. It's like, oh, it was cool. Be ready to backflip. Fun stuff. I didn't even have to backflip. It was sort of just like, I don't know. It's just unnecessary to backflip. Oh god, I'm gonna die. I think I was having flat out trouble with this level because, I mean, I just kept on dying and dying and getting hurt and one ups. Good stuff. Alright, maybe... How much left do we have? We got coins down there. I'll get, I'll get some of the... Oh god, I just glitched. That was cool, I guess. Because I didn't die from the glitch that killed me, so that's good. So now we made it to this lovely little place. Oh, it's Bowser. Hey, Bowser. Oh, you're gonna shoot rocks. That's fun. I'll just get one of these that you just happen to leave here, you idiot. So, gravity sucks here, and... Oh god! They sort of just, like, crumbled. That was cool, I guess. Let's fight. On the sun. Maybe not. What do you have to say for yourself, Bowser? Of course. He doesn't even, like, refer to me as Luigi. The space pits. Alright, so in the Bowser fight, really all you have to do is watch his jumps and make him jump on these little blue things. Or it's like a mag molten sun and his tail will get burned. And we just have to spin around. We have to make him spin around and all get hurt. It's a good time. So he's the one exploding and getting pummeled into space bits, or star bits, I should say. But he's gonna send some atomic shockwaves. Ow, oh, we're gonna get hurt. We're gonna make him jump over here. Here we go. Make him stomp on that. And once he sees us, he'll turn around. And Hulk exposes his hot tail thing. And then we'll just shoot him over there, or spin him around after he's spinning around. It's easier to beat the boss than explain how to beat him. Now, the dickhead Bowser's being, he's been destroying all these crystal-like star things, which would contain coins. So that's sort of, like, uncool say the least. Now we're just going to make him jump on one more of these. Go that way. Oh. He's on a weird pattern. There we go. He got to spin him once. The other way. Now he's coming. It's like so fast, but you know, we're able to hit him over. He'll fall and on his head. Get beaten up. He looks bigger. Like, that whole entire thing just sort of... Oh, he does call me Luigi. Oh, well then that's cool. And he explodes, and we beat Bowser, except we didn't. But look, there's a Grand Star. I don't get how just beating Bowser and the absence of Bowser just makes the Grand Star appear, but, you know, I could care less. Can you stop? I want to... Whatever, I want to long jump into it, but... That's fine. Dun, 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 dun. You know the theme. Why am I singing to it? So we got a grand star. That's good. Fun stuff. So now a new location in our little area will be revealed. 
Wait a second. We're only at 10 minutes right now. That's fine. Notice how it changes colors every time you add a new grand star to it. It's cool. So now we have a new, like I said just now, a new area discovered. A nice little brick house we got going on there. So 27 would be our number at this moment in time. And we discovered a new galaxy. We discovered four new galaxies. Actually, so here we're gonna have Rosalina tell us some obsolete stuff. She probably already told us before. Yes. Mm, yeah, you definitely said this before. Um, yeah, we'll save our game. And I think we'll end it off here. So. Board is missile. Anyone who Oh, you got a You got a mail for me? Princess Peach? Well this is gonna be useless because I'm gonna be turning off the Wii, but mm, oh, alright. So five one ups. Yes, I will take them. As soon as my Wiimote decides to react. Pretty? Is that what his voice actor decided to Okay. Well five one ups. Oh darn. Anyway, so for dismissal, anyone who beat Bowser and got a grand star this episode.